Okay, so Kevin McKidd, star of Modern Warfare 2. How's it feel being on the red carpet or the it's camouflage the carpet? Camo, the camel carpet, it's very, very exciting. It's, uh, I've never seen a premiere. I think this is the first ever premiere of video game in Leicester Square. Um, and it's quite a thing. It's, it's it just, you realize how big a phenomenon these games and this game has become. It's, I think it's the biggest selling game or will be the biggest selling game of all time. And um, it's exciting to be part of it. How different is it walking the, the, the red carpet for, again, camouflage carpet for a, a game premiere as, as opposed to a film premiere? It's, it's actually, it's exactly the same. It's, it's uncannily the same, you know? Um, but it just shows you what a following this game has, all the people that are here. I mean, it's massive. It really is massive. And for those that don't know your role in the game, your character, talk us through a bit about Soap McTavish. I played Captain Soap McTavish, um, who you wore him in the previous game, but now he's the leader of the, um, you know, the uh, the unit. Um, he is a badass, as they'd say. Uh, he's very, very hardcore military guy, and um, he has my voice. And uh, I hope, uh, yeah, and I hope it did a decent job because it's hard. These sessions are hard because you're reading lines off a piece piece of paper, and you have no context for what the is go is going on sometimes. So it's quite hard to you know um, to do this. It's harder work than it looks. You know? And are you a gamer yourself? Do you enjoy playing it? I, I, I used to, it's funny, my son is a nine-year-old and he has an Xbox, but he's not playing these kind of games. I have played Modern Warfare and it's fantastic. I don't know how they're possibly going to better this game, and they, but they, they must have done. They obviously have, because uh, of the buzz that's around this this, this event and this, this release. Um, so I play more <laughs> Lego Star Wars, stuff like that. That's where I'm at, because I sit with him and play, you know? You don't let him play Modern Warfare 2, I imagine? No, I haven't, no. I wait until he's in bed and then I'll maybe sling that one in. And very finally, any more games in the pipeline? Do you, do you, would you like to do more games? I, I enjoyed doing this, and I'll be interested to see. Yeah, I'd be happy to do a game. You know, and it's it's, it's it feels almost like doing a radio play to me, um, because in America they don't really do radio plays, and I used to do a lot of radio plays when I was living in Britain. So it feels like it almost replaces that, scratches that little itch, because I used to love the radio play thing. You get to go in, you don't have to wear a costume. You can be drinking a cup of coffee and doing your thing while you're, you know, and it's fun. And uh, so, yeah, I would do it.